Pete's been a bit here. Um, at the Team Reflector Super Shed. Um, kind of getting ready for uh, a quick trip up to York today, which is quite exciting. I've not been to York for a little while. Um, oh, by the way, Mark, uh, I haven't forgotten. Those are your upsack with garden chairs right there, ready for the next shoot. Um, yeah, we're on our way up to York in a minute because uh, we're going to be meeting up with the rather cool and rather talented Clinton Lofthouse, a very, very good um, sort of action filmy, movie postery kind of um, photographer, um, a friend of Nick Hardy's actually, and they've both invited me up to do some filming with them uh, for a well-known um, photography website and then talk about like longer term see what we can do in terms of like collaborations as us as YouTubes tend to do so yeah it should be good um cheeky parrots with me today I hear it's gonna rain later don't know about that but uh yeah I think if I can get this gear loaded up and ready to go we can uh, we can take cheeky parrot out to the York Viking Center because she's always wanted to go there and to the dinosaur museum because well she likes dinosaurs Let's go then, shall we? My channel is awesome, what are you talking about? No, Hi! I don't need to see my beautiful face. You'll be, yeah, but you know, <laughs> sometimes you can, you, you, you gotta see my stupid, rugged, ugly face, which has a certain charm. Why do we say Unlike your, where you're just too pretty. <laughs> All right, I'll tell you what, someone, I'm, I can't remember who it was now, somebody said on the, on the, on the comments on the Facebook um, page, um, we got a photo of us two when we arrived, we arrived at Yulvik. And they were like, oh, looks like Cheeky Parrot won, won the uh, hat competition then. She looks well cool. And she, yeah, only because she literally took it off my head as we were walking out the door. <laughs> Damn you all. <sighs> this is the beauty of living with uh, fashion conscious kids, guys. It's, uh... no, I know. It's just, it, it doesn't eat your stuff. Especially when you, you've got gay fashion conscious kids who like, who like to dress like boys. They keep nicking my stuff all the time. How dare you? Well, they are comfy to be fair. They're like, they're like a warm hug. They're great. I tell you. So we've arrived here at uh, York Photo Studio. It's rather cool. It's all right. It's got a fridge and Jaffa cakes. Yeah, Jaffa cakes for the win. To be fair. Ah, I got a quill. You did get a quill. I to be fair, I got a Viking bracelet. We thought, you know, when in York. Um, we might as well do it. So we did the whole York Viking Centre thing, didn't we? Um, Suggested by my history teacher. Shout out to my history teacher. Hi, history teacher. Hi. Don't want to say your name because I don't want to get. No, no, we, we don't. We do. We don't do Dave. We do. Don't break the protection here. Let's call him Dave. Hello, Dave, the history teacher. Hi, Dave, the history teacher. Pretty cool. He know. He know. He. She. He. he they. I suppose it's more polite to say they these days, isn't it? They know who they are. Um, yeah, it's good for me actually, because I, I used to go to York Vac Centre a lot with my parents when I was about her age. Um, and it's all changed. It used to be like a little thing on a train track and it went around and now it's like a like a cable car thing that you sit in and it's got like touch screens on the front and different languages. It's pretty cool. They still still got the steep pods. It smells horrible. It doesn't smell horrible. It it's smells fine. horrible. It does it's that, it smells. <laughs> it smells like York. And Not during Viking times, York. On a Saturday night. Not York on a Saturday night. <laughs> Anything but York on a Saturday night. Yeah, very true. Little story, we love York, but uh, we were here on a shoot uh, a couple of months back 
and just happened to come across uh, 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 your pride, which was awesome. And the gay community were all being nice and right, but then like the streets along the side, there were people, quite obviously straight people, like um, stags and everything, and they were just like being really rowdy and shouting stuff at people, and it's like, it's not on. Lovers love people. Just, just accept it. It's fine. Shut your face. There you go. So says Cheeky Pie. So today, yeah, we've got Clinton Lofthouse, who is awesome. If you go on the bottom screen there, um, you can you can go and check him out. He's very good. He does kind of like movie. He does photos as if they're like stills from a movie, which is kind of what fits in with Team Reflector quite well. Um, so we're just you know doing a bit of a vlog with him, see see how he works, and take it from there. Really, you're the AC, so you've got to pass the lenses and stuff, aren't you? And uh, make the t we've got her making the tea and probably doing homework knowing you because you, you know with, with the quill hence the quill um quill of life yeah and i'm going to take that hat back you do know that mm -mm, no i am mm -mm. yeah you just go like that <laughs> oh damn it exactly. worth a try okay uh, i guess let's get on with it and get to work shall we it gotta throw, throw the hat over the lens that's what youtubers do no nope. they do they go woo no, no, okay. Pro cushion. What's the idea between the shoot then, my friend? So this is a, a test shoot for death stoppers, and the concept is Nick. Well, the concept is one what I just came up with the other day. The fake, Nick is going to be a fake action hero, fake, um, dressed in a preacher outfit, mm -hmm. and he's going to be from a film I made up in my head, uh, and he's fighting some assailants inside his church, and he's got. Well, I think I'm going to go with this yeah. this thing, which is crazy. It's very <laughs> like double compensating. <laughs> and I'm going to do two shots. One maybe full length body, and one closer to his face to get the cinematic backlighting. I'm spitting sweets everywhere, but it's all good. <laughs> um, yeah, and we're going to have a little play around as well. I should explain for the YouTube viewers who are watching my version of the vlog, uh, Nick and I work in the film industry, so Nick's um, uncle runs a business that provides the film industry with all this kind of crap. So luckily for him, um, we can provide this kind of crap. <laughs> so yeah. Do, you, do I need to do it in my posh voice? Nah, I do it in your normal voice, mate. Hello, I'm Clinton Lofthouse. I live in York. I am a photographer and digital artist from England. I guess how long have you been doing this? What made you start to do Ooh, all been this? Doing, <laughs> doing this before the dawn of time. Yes. Six, no, actually seven years. Or is it eight? I'm not sure. In the world of social media, that is pretty much. Around so, eight years. I bought a camera about eight years ago. Yeah. And I pressed this magic button on Photoshop and became a Zen master. And what we're flying now? <laughs> I don't know what to say. Zen master. <laughs> yeah, but you know, he's, he's never. I mean, these two only take uh, stills, so you know, it's. Uh, you know, it's not that hard, is it? I mean, I take 24 stills every second, but you know, I'm, I'm not sure enough. It's Don't fine. we have to show an entire story in one image as opposed to draw it out over time? <laughs> isn't, that, isn't that a bit harder? Yeah. For us? yeah. It's um, stop motion, but over millions of centuries. Damn you, Nick. Nick. Make it, making a case for being a photographer. Nick <laughs> is, uh, has been alive since the dawn of time. He pretty much has, actually. He's more of a concept than a man. Yeah. <laughs> he's like the Joker. He's not a person. He's just a... He's, the, he's an idea. An idea. <laughs> and where can everyone find? 
usually drunk in an alleyway somewhere. Now you can find me on social media, Clinton Lofthouse Photography. You can find me on Instagram, Clinton Lofthouse Photography. You can find my website, Clinton Lofthouse Photography. And I'm Clinton Lofthouse. There you go. And it's down there for everybody. And he seems to think he's rock and roll for yeah. some reason. Well, magic, amazing tats. Look at the state, state of them. They're awesome. That's <laughs> one. That's one. Clinton Lofthouse. We're about as alone. You're welcome. See Thank you. Next you. One. Very Sorry. much. I like to move it, move it, move it.